So today we're talking about 5G. As a matter of fact, if you've seen this on your phone, if you, you see the little 5G logo at the top, guess what? You don't have 5G. What's up everybody, my name is Sean, welcome to my tech channel. Today, we're talking about 5G. If you have AT&T, you may have noticed the 5G E logo at the top. And that is not the 5G everyone's been talking about. E stands for evolution, and all that is, it's a fancy name for the new version of LTE. The previous version was clocking at about 37 megabits per second. 5G E, or the new LTE, clocks in at about 40 megabits per second. Verizon and some of the other carriers have already had this new technology and they simply call it LTE Advance or on your phone, you still see it as LTE. But even though AT&T improved to 40 megabits per second, they're still far behind Verizon at almost 57 megabits per second. I will include the link down in the description below so you can get an update of all the carriers and where they stand with 5G. This is a nice article that they continue to update it. Verizon is rolling out uh, some small scale 5G in April 2019. And in the second half of 2019, AT&T is going to start T-Mobile by 2020. And Sprint has already gone live in about nine cities. Thank you so much for watching. Please give me some feedback. Let me know if you liked it or not how can i improve this content if you're a new visitor please consider subscribing if you came back for another video as a return subscriber thank you so much i could not have had this channel without your support i'll see you in the next one <laughs>